Hey, 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 people. Um, this is a very, very late update video from me. Um, apologies if this is a weird angle. I'm doing this in a new, in a new environment. I'm not in my room in my house at the moment. I am in the lounge. Um, everybody has gone out um, doing fun things, and I am here desperately trying to get work done. I almost wasn't gonna do an update video because it has been a few days since the end of the month when I would usually post a video, but I thought, you know what, while well, I've got the time and uh, while I'm here, I thought I thought I would if anybody wants to know what I'm up to. So uh, talk about an eventful month. Um, basically uni has like, is in full swing now. Um, the work has been coming in by the bowlful and I've been making friends and I've been getting to know people and uh, yeah, learning about the work, what I'm able to do, what I'm not able to do. Um, it's all just kind of coming together. Um, yeah, October's been, it's been very busy in that sense, but I can generalize it pretty easily in that um, it's it's just been a great time. Just been making friends, just been doing uni work. Um, I haven't died yet, as you can tell. <laughs> um, I've made some very, very close friends um, in the time that um, since the last video, and I think that's really great. And what I also think is really, really great is that um, everyone is doing a fantastic job at uh, calling me Jace and using my pronouns, um, which is fantastic. It's really, really good. Um, I feel really comfortable about it. I guess because I there's not much else to talk about with uni, like just in general, it's going okay. Um, I guess I'm going to use this video, I guess, kind of to talk about gender stuff, really. I, I've been trying to stay off it for the last uh, couple of update videos because, like, gender is not controlling my life as much as it seemed to um, before I moved out and I could fully um, express myself the way I want to. But um, yeah, I thought uh, I can use this time to talk about gender stuff if you, if you want to know about that. So basically I'm just very comfortable being gender fluid or non-binary. Um, uh, since I did my uh, last video in July where I basically explained that um, I'm not comfortable being female and I don't know if I if I'm if I can actually count as being transgender. Um, a lot of people have been pointing this out to me, but since I uh, made that video, technically if you're non-binary or gender fluid or whatever, you are still not cisgender, so that in turn makes you transgender. So basically, anyone who is not the gender they were assigned at birth is trans, you can put it that way. And so, uh, <laughs> and so I've discovered that in the last few months, so, um, I mean, I guess. I guess you can call me trans, but again, the whole thing of I don't feel fully masculine. Again, I'm still coming to terms with how I feel, and especially moving out, moving away from the parents where they're not down my throat the whole time, and just having this freedom to express myself how I want to, and see how people um, react to me, how people get to know me. Um, yeah, it's kind of made me realise that I'm probably... Again, I'm still not comfortable being female, feminine, or anything. Like, seriously, if you misgender me now as she, her, whatever, like, I'm I'm past that point now. It's just really uncomfortable. Um, so, uh, I don't want to sound like a broken record, but they, them, their pronouns. Please, um, they are what I'm most comfortable with. If you have to misgender me in the gender binary, then use the male pronouns. Um that I've, they have been used occasionally with other people and um, and I myself have been, at first I've been a bit confused because I've been like, who are they talking about? What, who is this male that they're talking about? And then I realised, oh, it's me. Um, <laughs> and so, um, and I think that's probably more me. If I were referring to myself, I would use they, them and there because that's what I'm most comfortable with. But of course, people are still finding it very difficult. But if you're still finding it very difficult, then I would suggest use male pronouns if you have to misgender me as 
as either male or female, just misgender me as male, basically. But I would much prefer to be they, them, and there, because I think gender fluid is very... I used it at the time because I wasn't sure if I was fluctuating, because technically, gender flu when you're gender fluid, it means you're fluid between different genders. You are not staying in one set place in one set gender, and that's what separates it from being trans, from being non-binary, I guess. Um, but yes, in, in the last few months, I feel like it's not as fluid. I feel like it's not as... F I, my gender is not as fluid as I thought it would be. Um, I thought that I would fluctuate between being v a very serious male and, um, and maybe a little bit of non-binary and then, like, serious occasional female. Like, occasion occasions I will feel female and not feel uncomfortable with it. But now it's just, after I've done some more, like, I've been around new people who know me as Jace and know to use my pronouns and so learning about that I think I'm probably most comfortable with the term non-binary I think for me at the moment I I don't feel comfortable being female obviously excuse me but I also don't feel comfortable being male like sometimes it just it's still hard to get my head round and so, and again, as I mentioned in my last video, like, that there's no way I can truly pass as a male. It's just not gonna happen, like, no matter how hard I try. Um, so I, I guess I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to take the non-binary label, I guess, if, if I have to choose a label. Um, but to be honest, I just wanna, I just want people to know me as me. I don't more want to explain myself every time I meet someone new or anything. Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I think that's me. Uh, at the moment, if you, if you've gotten to the end of this, thank you very much for watching. If you were very, very interested in, uh, what I, <laughs> what I needed to update on. Um, obviously it's November now and we're coming to winter. And uh, hopefully my next update video should be on time. I should not be drowning in uni work. That, that's the thing that's happened this week is I've, I have I have had a deadline on Monday, which I was working on all, all week, like two weeks before. And I have um, a deadline in tomorrow, actually, that I still need to send off. And then the week after that, I have another deadline. So it's been very, very busy. And I've been very, very stressed. And... Uh, but once all of that's done, I don't have any other deadlines until, like, January. So, uh, I should be able to chill out a little bit, um, <laughs> somewhat. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching if you've, uh, reached this point of the video. And, uh, yeah, that's me. Um, long story short, I'm pretty happy at the moment. Um, nothing serious that has destroyed my life has really happened. Yeah, at least, um gender stuff is being a bit more confirmed and now that I know that people are really trying and it's sticking and stuff is all coming together. So yeah, thanks very much guys. Um, hopefully I shall, uh, you can see me in my next update video at the end of the, end of the month. So uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.